brought to you by Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Siege. Siege the day. In stores now. Rated M for Mature. Rainbow Six Siege is a game that rewards team planning. And if esports has taught us anything, planning starts at team selection. A well-chosen team will be well-positioned to well and truly stick it to their opponents. So here are the defensive roles that will serve you well in your mission to withstand any siege. Amateurs. Though it can take a while for bullets to start flying, the knowledge war is waged right from the get-go. Information warriors can help your team in two very important endeavors. A, learning stuff, and B, stopping the other team from learning stuff. Deploying Mute's electronic jammer early can put a halt to the roly-poly drone parade. Leave your enemies in the dark and make them burn valuable time searching for you. Put the jammer at one choke point and cover the other yourself, shooting any sausage rolls that come your way. Once that phase is over, smash any drones deactivated by your jammer, then pick it up and reposition it. You can prevent remote breaches and stop further drone shenanigans as you tighten up around the objective. Now that the enemy is en route, get everyone's favorite looky-loo, Pulse, on the scene. If you see some telltale hearts hanging out on the other side of a wall, use the ping system to put a marker on the wall and then tell your teammates to open fire. Who says attackers have to be the ones to open hostilities? No matter what position you're defending, there are a lot of ways the attackers can get at you. This is where the booby trappers come in. Their gadgets help shut down avenues, so you can watch other avenues with your gun. Ideally, something like Capkin's explosive tripwires will kill an attacker outright, allowing you to set it and forget it. But they do leave a bolt through the wall that can be spotted and dealt with by savvy enemies. Be sure to position yourself close enough to your traps to hear when they are being dismantled so you can respond appropriately. The audio in Rainbow Six Siege conveys key information about everyone's whereabouts, so listen up and stay as quiet as you can. Set in C4. Four remaining. Another booby trap trick is turning regular old reinforced barricades and barbed wire into zappy reinforced barricades and barbed wire with Bandit's shock battery. One of these inside a wire nest will turn it into a barbecue for any careless little scout rolls and make it a pain for any headstrong attackers. Once you hear the enemy start to deal with your booby traps, it's time to activate your sleeper agent. This is the operator that you sent out into the field to lie in wait to pounce on the attacking team once they were focused on your defenses. You did that, right? You don't want to pull this move every time, and it may sometimes be a suicide mission, but you can usually catch some of the attacking team unaware and create a nasty distraction to allow your teammates to strike. Sneaky. As a defender, it's important to use all of the weapons in your arsenal, and that includes the clock. The attacking team is on a timer, so the more seconds you can burn, the closer you get to victory, and the more pressure you'll put on the attackers to make rash mistakes. This is the motto of clock burners like Smoke. His remote detonated gas traps are a great area denial tool. They are the second thing you should throw into a freshly blown breach, with C4 being the first, and they make great cover when you're retreating back towards your objective. You can also burn time by simply staying alive longer and being the threat that slows your enemy's progress. Rook can improve your whole team's survivability with his bag of armor jackets, and Doc's revival syringe can turn a bad situation into a slightly less bad yeah. situation, provided you or your down teammate is only suffering from a flesh wound and not, you know, death. Shooting a teammate to revive them is a big improvement on scurrying up to them yourself, as revive opportunities are often traps laid by attackers who still have eyes on your downed ally. Heed the lessons of Saving Private Ryan, folks. The last key members of a defensive powerhouse are the gun shooters. I mean, everyone needs to be a gun shooter if you're gonna stand a chance, but this Tachanka fellow, well, let's just say he takes gun shooting to a whole different level. His deployable mounted gun will chew up attackers and destructible cover with equal enthusiasm. So, if you can get Pulse to scout the attacker's entry point and set up quickly, you are the man of the hour. Well, minute. Okay, more like 20 seconds. This mounted gun puts a huge target on Tachanka's position, making him incredibly vulnerable to alternate firing angles or grenades. Make your loud and deadly debut, then pack the thing up if you've got a moment, or just get the heck out of there. 
The more that the attackers feel threatened by you, the better. Stay calm, communicate with your teammates, and don't just freak out when the breach charges start going off all around you. With a properly stacked team, the odds are ever in your favor. Tell us your preferred role in the comments below and stand tall against any and all sieges. Friendly Victoria, hostiles eliminated.